Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd do a colour and chat from Best of This Is Female Heroes by Hatchet Heroes. And I thought I would do this page here. And this is a body colour with a girl called Cindy on Facebook and it's been a body colour for a few months now. So I thought I'd start off with the black outline and I usually do them with these, like barrow pens, but I recently bought Posca pens. This one is the 3M one, but I do have the one and I do have the micro. I think I might use the micro, which hasn't even been prepped yet, because it's got such a tiny nib. So I'll just pump it a little bit, see if anything comes out. I've already got the number one sorted. So, just sorting out my blotter page. It is on this side, which I don't really like doing these side pages, but it is what it is. Yeah, it is this way. I was thinking, is it like, cause the picture is landscaped? Is it landscaped? But it is actually this way. You've got loads of colours on this one. Let's see if you guys could guess who it is in the comments down below. I'm going to try my hardest here. Never used this um, nib before. I am holding down the spine a little bit because it is like spring and open. You can possibly see who it is to be honest. So how is everybody today? I'm fine. I've just finished my image out of Kauai Town and I'm going to be honest guys I absolutely love it so I hope you guys love it too something I've never really done sorry guys I'm really like trying to figure out which lines were This is a very detailed page, to be honest. This book is the only book I know so far that has wish characters. And it only has 10 pages of wish. So if you like wish, which is a nice, like, movie if I'm honest. Wouldn't go crazy over it but it's not one that I wouldn't pass on. It's a good movie to be honest. So cute. It's like a prequel to um, what's it called? Snow White. I want to thank everyone who has subscribed to me, who is a returning subscriber. You guys are amazing. 
Yeah, this video I'm going to do mainly the outline. Because that's how I do it. I do them in number order. I know some people wait till the end to do the outline, but not me. This is so detailed. But yeah, um, I like these Posca pens for the outline, to be honest. I'm not going to all do paint pens. I think my black outline is going to be paint pens. I find it does go a little bit quicker, but obviously this one's like really detailed, so this is taking me a bit longer. But usually it does take like minutes compared to um, a pen. I'm just trying not to go over the lines or anything that I shouldn't. So I do apologise right now if I don't do as much as I usually do when I call and chat, but this is pretty much my first time using paint pens on the camera. And this paint pen does dry quite nicely. I have done one page already in these books with it and it looks amazing. I think these were like three for like ten pound on Amazon. If anyone knows any black acrylic paint pens that you think I might like, just put my hand in that. Um, let me know in the comments down below. Anyone else excited for the new Wicked movie? I'm really excited for it. Literally just been talking to my sister about it. And apparently they did the live singing because they wanted the movie to really feel like a West End. And apparently it is in two parts, which I get because if you have watched the West End, it is in like two different acts. And one act is like who Alphabet is and like how she grows to become like a woman and all that and then the second part is like after like the Wizard of Oz type thing so it'd be good if they do a movie like that where the first half's like getting to know Alpha and who she is and you know, like the backstory, and then obviously the second part is after you've watched Wizard of Oz, and then you watch the second part of that movie. I think that's how they're planning on doing it, to be honest. It'd be really fun, that. So what's everyone been doing? I've literally been doing like body colours and stuff like that, like I usually do. My weekend was lovely, if anyone is wondering. I did meet Deadpool. A dog pool, not Deadpool. I'd love to meet Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> but a girl can only dream. Um trying to figure out where we're actually going here. Um, I know this part here is the eye.
Yeah, the Mac Dog Pro, and I think I said it in my last video, but I'll say it again. She is so cute. Like, so cute. I really want to take her home. I wouldn't call her the ugliest dog in Britain at all. If anything, she's actually really pretty. And she's got loads of money now, hasn't she? I just love the fact that um, I got to meet her. I've got a little paw print and everything, or photograph. It's just the best, best experience in my life. She's such a cute little dog. But like I said in my other video, when am I ever going to meet a dog again? You got more chance of meeting a celebrity human than a celebrity dog twice. Yeah, so that was a lovely little Saturday and I, it was lovely to catch up to my cousin that I haven't actually spoken to in literally 15 years. Not because of bad things or anything, it's just life is life, isn't it? <coughs> but it was lovely to like catch up with them. And yeah. I've just been doing a lot of um, <coughs> colouring today. As you can tell, my voice is literally going today. I think it's because the weather's gone really cold. Looks like crazy, doesn't it? If you guys are wondering, I will show you what I'm colouring. And it is going to be this one here. So, hopefully it looks good. <laughs> At the minute it looks a bit crazy. And if you are wondering as well, it doesn't bleed through at all to the other side. It doesn't even ghost or not. Which is lovely. The spine's doing my head in a little bit. Oh, I think I've... Never mind. <laughs> it's okay. It needs to be done. Yeah, I love Wish. Wish is one of my favourite um, movies because... I just love how it, like, told a story before... Sorry, wait. Really good twist. I'm not going to spoil it for people if they haven't watched it, but I will highly recommend you watch it. And Christmas time is a perfect time to watch Disney movies, to be honest. Let's be honest, Disney is like life it's it's amazing it's been literally like figuring out where's what on this page and i'm trying my hardest not to rub my hand into the paint It is also hard with a tripod in my way a little bit. Can't exactly see where I'm going.
It looks crazy, but this is how I do it. I do like the double outline and then I colour it in. I know some people fill while they're colouring in type thing and I can't do that. I can't do the um, whole like leave the outline to the end. Can't do that either. Gotta do them in number order as it really stresses me out. And most of the colour by numbers by Hatcher Heroes, number one is black. There's a few books that they don't start off black. The last colour is black. That's the only time when I would do the outline last, is when literally the book tells me to. This is not for the, um, like, beginner people. I wouldn't really say this one's a beginning friendly book. For saying that, the one next to it that I have completed, <clears throat> and I did complete in July, which was Tiana, she was very easy and very quick to do. So it just depends on the image, to be honest. I like these compilation books as well because it gives you a chance to, like, use different, like, levels of like difficulty sometimes the um, more intimidating ones are like the really detailed ones for me but then sometimes i'm like i love loads of colors so it's like a win for me If these weren't all like colour by numbers and it was mainly like me think myself of the colours, I'd probably get overwhelmed and probably never pick up the book because the colours are already picked out for me, I think it's a little easier on my head. And you don't have to do all the shading and that, you could literally like look at this palette here and be like, okay, so this is browns, yellow, pink, red, purples, greys, skin colour. So what you do is like take a couple of these browns because like, you know, the dark ones and all that you don't need. You could possibly do that one, like number three instead of two, because two and three look very similar, or two and five. Take one of them out and then like use six instead of three and then four you know what i mean or you can use like where it's got ear and number six and my eyes look very similar you can take one of them all but i don't do that i, I literally try my hardest to get every single color like the same but you could simplify it you don't even have to do shading because spicy cat colors here on youtube she doesn't do any of the shading in these books and they still look just as swimming That's going to take me a bit, isn't it? I call it a little braid in there. Probably going to like fill in these lines here so you guys can see how I wear it when it will be all completed in that.
I don't know what the colour in this people here. And as you can tell, it doesn't bleed through or not. No ghost and not. I'll do the other eyeballs as well, because it's there. And I'll do these two eyeballs as well. Oh, you guys can see that one. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Feel like I'm completely off camera today. Can't wait to get some more of these for Christmas. I think I'm getting like the Ice Age one. Well, I'm hoping to get the Ice Age one and the Prince one. And then, I know I really want the little books as well. I think I ordered as well when, well, I asked for two of the Mickey Mouse ones as well. I know they're all the ones, but. I think I have asked for them as well. I've asked for quite a few of them, that's why I'm like, I can't remember. But like I said, thank you for everyone who has subscribed and supported the channel. I am going to try and um, do more TikToks as well, if anyone is wondering. Because I haven't been on TikTok in a while, I got loaded. But that will go back soon. I've also asked for uh, a new set of colour pencils, the 500 set ones, because I feel like with these, if you got like that many colours, you're sure you got enough to like, for all the colours, you know what I mean, like I'm sure you got enough for all the colours. Oh, it's spooky, doesn't it? <laughs> I don't like goats, but he is adorable. There's a little star. Probably my favourite in the media, to be honest. If you have made it this far into the video, comment down below star or send a star emoji. Just gonna do I think this little bit of here. I don't usually do this, but kind of enjoying myself. 
And also, I don't want to spoil the whole image for you guys, so. I'm just going to do this line and then call it a video. Isn't his name like Valentino, I think? The goat's name in Wish. I know her name's Asha. But I'm sure his name's Valentino. I'm not very good with all their names, to be honest. I just know Asha's one. Another movie I absolutely love is Elementary. I think I've only got one picture on these type of books of Elementary, which is kind of sad. But I think the Prince one has some in it, which is lovely. If you want me to get any Hatcher Hero books that you don't think I have, comment down below or let me know over on Instagram. And I will have a little see if I've got it. And if I haven't, I'll buy it. It can be Disney, it can be not Disney type one. If you want me to go and check it out? Because, like I said, I love, love these books. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, turn the notification bell on. Don't forget to follow my Instagram, follow my Facebook group page, and also give my TikTok a little bit of love. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.